Yay. Yay. Does it go like right. left? You, you can you if you go. turn it, yeah. Oh, cool. Cool. All right. Um, right, I'm Rose. Um, hey, Rose. Basically, um, this is a project uh, like a prototype I made uh, a couple of years ago, I guess, uh, in university. And uh, just like in the last year, I've been um, like, you know, we, we recruited my team and uh, we decided to like, you know, let's make this game a bit more concrete because we thought it was it had like good potential and like we can make a cool game out of it. Um, so uh, yeah, this is just a prototype, um, and basically the game is uh, it's a shopping game. Uh, it's inspired by games like Overcooked. Um, so you're basically you have a list of items that you find you find in the store. And you have to find those items in like a time limit, and you have to go and get them and cash them out. Uh, and uh, you have like a limited amount of space on your cart uh, to do all of this. But here's like a demo, I guess. Uh, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Yeah, okay, this is good. It's very quiet. Here we go. of the levels are going to be quirky, you know, they're going to have like obstacles and things. Yeah. Um, some of the obstacles, uh, so here you go, here. you have a list, and this is the items on your, your, uh, in your cart. There's obstacles, for example, uh, food stands that stop and talk to you, and you have to like quickly tap to get rid of them. <laughs> mm. um, there's crowds, like Black Friday, you yeah. have to go, mad, like, <laughs> go, go, uh, walk through them. There's like slippery water and um, yeah, so there's thieves. Of course, they're going to steal your things. They steal like half of your items. Um, I haven't even paid for them yet. Huh? I haven't even paid for them yet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. All right, uh, you, you buy, that's, so when you buy them, um, there's also like coupons at the top there, which basically gives you a bonus. <laughs> <laughs> Give you like speed bonuses or like a teleporter or like a, a shield or something. Um, yeah, and uh, there's also a Scooter Joe guy. That's what we call him, Scooter Joe. Hmm. And he's just a guy on a scooter that runs Good up Lord, look at the carrots. <laughs> oh, the carrots. Oh, the, the giant, the giant. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so our basically our idea is that want to make, oh yeah, this, that's one of the abilities that you can use. Uh, so yeah, of course this is a prototype, so there's a lot of changes that we actually want to do. For example, I think we're going to get rid of the, the coupons because they seem a bit unintuitive, uh, but we're going to try to find other ways to incorporate like uh, power-ups and things into the game. But uh, for the most part, what we want to do is have, uh, you know, like a... Um, Oh, there's a teleporter. <laughs> oh. This is a very accurate shopping. Oh, no, yeah. this is, this is uh, I think, this is an ability to allow you to see where an item is, because there's some items oh. that are hard to find. A lot of the stress of this game is finding the items, yeah. because there's no way, of, there's no map or anything, so you just gotta go around and find them, which is actually <laughs> 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 I worked at a superstore for five years, and I can tell you this is completely accurate. Yeah. 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 Oh, there's a superstore. They also hitch the teeth of the carts, like throw them away. Yeah. 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 The old lady who flipped my food out the middle of the aisle. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So what we want to do is like have a world hub. So we want to make a story around the game as well, like a single player mode where. Uh, our idea is that you're a delivery robot. I don't know if you've ever seen, like in LA, they have like these little delivery robots that go around and yeah. cause trouble. Anyways, uh, we want like, to make a, a delivery robot and basically your goal is you have, um, like, you know on Uber Eats you get like orders and you get a ranking. Basically yeah. you're like an Uber Eats kind of delivery person. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And you get a score and stuff. Yeah. So, 
Yeah, so basically you have uh, like a, a delivery order and you have to go and do that delivery uh, in a certain amount of time, uh, of course, and then you would get a rating from it, basically. Um, so we want to make like a town where yep. there's a couple of shops and then they have, you have customers that might like call you and then you have to go and go to the store and get the things that they want. Mm. Um, we also want to incorporate co-op and multi like multiplayer modes, so a co-op mode where you could play with your friends, or a versus mode where you're two players and you have to, I don't know, get the most items like quicker than the other player. And uh, yeah, so but we think both of these ideas would be pretty fun to do. So that's what we plan on doing. Um, and uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep. Anyways, uh, we have. The thing that we're struggling out a little bit right now is that we're just programmers <laughs> in my team right now, and our story writing <laughs> skills are absolutely like not there. So <laughs> um, we're trying to we're trying to slowly figure out like the the plot. Um, some of the story that we were thinking is that you're in this society of these ro like delivery robots. You're in this kind of like I guess. A little, a little bit in the future where delivery robots are a bit more popular and people are lazy so uh, you're basically kind of slaves uh, for, for people and uh, we want to make like maybe a story where you kind of um, ally with the other robots and take over and, and make the humans deliver for you at the end of the day <laughs> or, or like save them or something dark. like you, you build a rocket and you just like make a new society in, in another planet or something. I don't know, uh, something really silly. Like we want this to be a silly game. Um, and uh, what else? Oh, we wanted, like I said, uh, we want to incorporate upgrades. So we were thinking maybe there's a way that we could add in some special items in the store that are maybe harder to find. And then if you go and find them and purchase them, maybe you could give yourself an upgrade. You are a robot, so you could like give yourself some mods and I saw there was a URL there. Is that is this publicly like the demo or the build? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, um, is that something I can download from there? The, I actually wanted to show you something. I want to send it out for sure. Um, I mean, it's on my, my Discord. Yeah. Uh, art. Oh, yeah. So I already made like, I'm already like modeling nice. the, the <laughs> delivery robot yeah. character. Mm. arm and put it into your your grocery basket on your back and he's like inspired by like uh you know like a delivery guy on like a scooter like that's like mm. <laughs> literally the inspiration and um i don't know simple like we could easily change the colors to make the if we're playing multiplayer it's very identifiable if you want if I, we want to add like upgrades i feel like it would be really easy to add some cool features to Exemplify that, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. awesome. That's, that's, awesome. Awesome. Yeah, that's my favorite <laughs> kind of game where, like, every time I see it, I'm like, oh, but what if you could also do this? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, no, I, I'm super open to like any suggestions, and <laughs> yeah, put the link on our yeah, we'll put the link, yeah, 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 there, you could play. I have the prototype that you could play too, so awesome. yeah. Yeah. great, thank you. <laughs>